a lot of the uh, speculation is that let's say uh, on the MLS, there's a property that is uh, advertising on the MLS that the listing brokerage is willing to pay 3% to the buyer's broker uh, if they close on that deal with their buyer. But then there's another uh, property that states they'll only pay 2% or another property. I've seen properties that have said they'll only pay 1%. And the some of the things you're hearing out there is that brokers won't show homes for less than 2.5% or 3% or 2% or whatever. I have never found that to be the case. I have been paid when working with buyers anywhere from 1% to 3% and typically right around 2.5, 2 to 2.5%, typically right around 2.5%. Um, but I've never made that decision in terms of what houses I'll show the buyer based on what commission is being paid to my brokerage and what I'll split with my brokerage. That's never been a concern of mine. And I'll, I'll, I'll put it out there. I do not believe that's ever been a concern of any broker that is working with a buyer. The bottom line is, as a buyer's agent, we are your fiduciary. We are there to help you find the house that you want to buy regardless of the commission, regardless of the commission. So I, you know, I, I have a little problem with everyone speculating that brokers will only show homes that are where the co-op commission is two and a half percent or higher or two percent or higher. I have never found that to be the case. And uh, does it happen? It probably does happen in some occasions, but I do not find that to be the norm. I have never found that to be the norm. And again, I've been doing this for 23 plus years and I have sold hundreds of millions of dollars in real estate. And that has never been a factor when I've worked with a buyer. And in my opinion, it's not been a factor in most cases across the board. Does it happen? Sure but I don't feel that that's the norm.